science and writing in fourth grade. We are so excited um, because this year, science and writing is a new class in fourth grade. Um, your child is a part of a team of three. So they have three teachers, one teacher teaching ELA, one teacher teaching math, and then one teacher teaching science and writing. And um, this is a pilot year for this program, um, but we know it's going to be awesome. We're super excited to see how it works out. Um, this science and writing class is going to under, enhance their understanding of science concepts um, in preparation for a fifth grade science test, but also it's just really going to grow their understanding of different things in the world and even more than that, develop their writing through science. They'll have a lot of different things to write about, but they'll also have different ways of writing through essays, paragraphs, blurbs, all different types of things that are going to be really fun. Remember, um, because your child is in a team of three, they might be doing different science work than students who are not in a team of three. We're teaching the same science standards, but we're just teaching them in a different time and in a different way. So if you see that your child's friend is studying something else in science, don't worry, just go ahead and um, check their newsletter, go to Canvas, contact their science and writing teacher, and make sure that they're on the right page. A huge plus of this class is we have more time to implement the standards. So we can go more in depth and spend more time exploring concepts. Um, we will be teaching writing through science. So students will get to learn how to express their findings orally and in written form. And this is so good for their brains to be able to express what they're finding in writing. Make sure that when you're completing your science work on Canvas, you look in your science class. Please don't look in the math class for science work, okay? Um, their science class on their Canvas dashboard is labeled SCI4, science, fourth grade, okay? Please make sure you're looking in the science class on their Canvas dashboard. What should your child expect out of this class? Definitely to be challenged. It's going to be hard. It's going to be rigorous. It's going to be tons of fun um, to learn new science concepts, to become an amazing writer. Like I said, they'll be writing all different types of things about a bunch of different types of things. So it'll really enhance their understanding and their growth as a writer. They should definitely expect to do fun experiments and learn about the STEM process. We're going to be learning about creating things, but also evaluating our work and going back and seeing how we can make things better. Um, also, finally, they'll be able to be a little bit prepared for the fifth grade science test next year and be a little bit more familiar with some of the concepts. Um, and of course, they're going to have tons of fun. Um, again, just a reminder that when you're looking in Canvas, make sure you're looking for science work in your science class. It should be labeled SCI4. And every week, the science and writing newsletter will be posted on Canvas under daily plans and under modules. But it'll also be sent home with your child in their binder. So make sure to look at the newsletter every day to see what we are completing in class, but also what's required of your student at home. It'll tell you the due date for everything. It'll tell you exactly what needs to be completed and where it is. This is just an example of what a newsletter might look like. Um, it'll tell you, show you exactly what we're completing in class, and then it'll give you the homework, and it'll tell you when it's due. Okay, so um, team, while we're in hybrid, Team Clinton and Team Arrows might look a little bit different. Okay, what we're doing in class and what we're doing at home might look a little bit different but eventually everyone will be caught up and we'll all be on the same page. Everyone's learning the same thing. It's just because of the days that everybody's coming to school, it might look a little bit different. We're so excited to be starting this class off with your kids this year. Please let us know if you have any questions.